Is there any better way to get adrenaline pumping through one's veins than off-road adventures behind the wheel of an extreme vehicle? You got that right, there certainly isn't. And to feature off-roading addiction, in this video we'll feature some of the latest all-terrain beasts that were created for the sole purpose to take a beating and transport you to those places where travelers rarely venture to. Plus, we have a couple more models simply designed to have fun away from the paved cities. Subscribe to our channel to be notified about the latest video releases and enjoy this mighty ride! Honda Rugged Open Air Vehicle Concept Presented at the 2018 SEMA show in Las Vegas, this is a new all-terrain concept that was designed by Honda R&D Americas and built using production components from the company's vehicles. Though slightly smaller than the Ridgeline pickup truck, Honda Rugged Open Air Vehicle or ROV is based on its platform but the body and suspension have been heavily modified. It also borrows doors directly from the production version of the Pioneer 1000 side-by-side -side, and is designed as inspired by the CTV. The vehicle has plenty of ground clearance and protective underbody skid plates. Though Rove's interior has no infotainment system, it uses Ridgeline components paired with Pioneer steering wheel and four Civic Type R seats. It is speculated that the off-roader is powered by 280-horsepower 3.5-liter V6 and a 6-speed automatic transmission from the Ridgeline. Torsus Praetorian The Ukrainian company Pulsar Expo was founded in 2014 as an importer of specialty vehicles. However, seeing that the demand for stock trucks and buses was rather low among the consumers, a decision was made to produce highly modified units for certain tasks. This is how the world's first off-road bus Torsus Praetorian was created. In essence, it is a Lego off-roader that is assembled using ready-made components imported from the US and the European Union. Being powered by the 240-horsepower six-cylinder in-row diesel from MAN, the bus can reach 73 mph top speed, while the 4x4 drive with the differential lock help it power through the toughest areas. Among the unique features are composite materials used in the body of the vehicle, which will prevent it from corrosion. The Praetorian is oriented towards countries with poor infrastructure as well as those areas that face extreme nature conditions. Hummer from Mills Pack 2006 was the last production year for the Hummer H1, and since then these hulky trucks slowly turned into collector's vehicles. The Millspec Automotive specializes on custom modification of these machines, strengthening weak points and improving already impressive capabilities. Since Hummers never possessed engines worthy of the truck's potential, Millspec trashes them and installs GM Duramax V8s with 500 horsepower and 1,000 pound-feet of torque output paired to a six-speed Allison transmission. To improve off-road prowess, steering system is enhanced, beefier CV drive shafts and stronger axles are installed. Plus, ARB locking differential provides true four-wheel drive capability. On the inside, Millspec Hummer ditches all the stock components, gets a dual air conditioning system, JL audio system, and custom gauges. Polaris Ranger XP1000 EPS High Lifter On the market for almost 65 years, Polaris is an American manufacturer of recreational and utility off-road vehicles. Currently, the company offers three side-by-side -side and two ATV series. One of the most capable off-roaders from Polaris is a special edition Ranger XP1000 EPS high lifter that is available in two seater and crew modifications. The side-by-side -side is built to conquer deep mud and buggy terrain as it rides on massive 20-inch outlaw two tires, boasts of 13.5 inches of ground clearance and 11 inches of suspension travel. For this purpose, it also gets high-mounted air intakes, new half doors with 1-inch trains, and mud-specific bumpers both front and rear. The High Lifter Edition is powered by ProStar 1000 twin-cylinder engine, delivering 82 horses. Easy Raider Even if you're a hardcore fan of off-roading, it is possible that you have never heard about this all-electric vehicle called Easy Raider. Unique in its design, this is a breed between a jet ski and a giant skateboard that can carry one rider and, depending on the modification, up to 300 pounds of total payload. The vehicle is offered in three modifications, 
the lightweight Easy Raider and more off-road capable HD2 and HD4 for extreme conditions. While the first two models are powered by two electric motors, the HD4 has one 1200W motor at each wheel, a 3000Wh battery and the riding range of around 49 miles. Interestingly, this model can be paired with a heavy-duty electric cart that is powered independently and has a maximum payload of 550 pounds. This video is a part of our continuous series about unusual vehicles. We have many more episodes that might excite you, so consider checking them out after you're done with this one. The links are waiting for you in the description and information cards. Let's keep rolling! Canem Outlander Max 6x6 XT Canem is a division of the Canada-based Bombardier Recreational Products that specializes in building side-by-side -side and all-terrain sport and utility vehicles. In 2015, the company added a new 6x6 model to their lineup of off-roaders. The Outlander Max 6x6 XT is the top-of-the-line model in the Outlander range that can conquer the toughest and most challenging terrain types. For more confident handling, the vehicle has two additional wheels in the rear, independent rear suspension and 9.5 inches of ground clearance. It is also equipped with a two-level cargo box that can hold up to 700 pounds of load and has industry-leading towing capacity rated at 1,650 pounds. Under the hood of the Outlander, there is an 82-horsepower Rotrix 1000 V twin engine made it to a rugged, continuously variable transmission. Tinger Track Tinger is a Russian Federation-based manufacturer of all-terrain vehicles with 10 years of experience. If you have ever dreamed of owning a personal tank, this company can build one for you. Moreover, their ATV will be able to replace five more different vehicles at the same time. The Tinger Track is ready to operate as a snowmobile, a tractor, a quad bike, a swamp buggy or even an amphibious vessel. Available engines are sourced from Cherry SQR and come in two modifications, a 600cc two-cylinder with 35 horsepower or an 812cc three-cylinder with 57 horsepower output. The Tinger is fuel-efficient and can operate under extreme weather conditions. It will be able to overcome 1.65 feet obstacles, 3.3 feet wide pits and 40% gradient hills. It is riding on tough steel tracks and can reach the max speed of 22 miles per hour. Project Force Defender 130 Land Rover Defender is a legendary four-wheel drive SUV that despite going out of production in 2016, still has crowds of fans around the world. Responding to their demand, many aftermarket customization companies turned their attention to the old Defender models and Florida-based ECD Automotive Design is one of them. The firm currently offers several modifications of the iconic SUV, with Project Force being one of the most off-road capable. Propelled by 565 horsepower 6.2 liter V8 from Corvette, the model breathes through a Borla performance exhaust and is powered via an updated stainless steel fuel system. It also gets a 2-inch Fox suspension lift and a new winch from Warren Industries. Plus, ECD reworked the interior of the car adding kilted leather seats, custom steering wheel and JL audio system. Errol Motors Alaskan Most of the custom motorcycles rarely leave paved roads of the city, since no one would like to hit beaten roads on a bike that has consumed thousands of dollars in modifications. But this isn't the case for the Alaskan from Earl Motors Company. The owner of the company, Alex Earl, created this build on the platform of the 2018 Ducati Scrambler Desert Sled, which possesses a strong frame, tall suspension and reliable 803cc L twin motor. In order to cover long distances away from the infrastructure, the bike was equipped with a 6-gallon hand-formed tank and an extra 2-gallon in the tail. Since temperatures in Alaska can be chilly even during the summer, the bike has heated grips and Barkbusters handguards. Jaguar F-Type Rally Concept One of the first Jaguar sports cars, XK120, was rather successful in RAC, Tulip and Alpine rallies. It saw the world all the way in 1948, 
and in order to commemorate its 70th anniversary, the company released two F-Type convertibles with design cues from the XK120 and the F-Type Checkered Flag Limited Edition. Built to follow FIA standards, both cars are powered by the same 2.0-liter engineum turbocharged four-cylinder engine netting 300 horses and are equipped with comprehensively upgraded brakes and suspension, including front and rear four-piston calipers, three-way adjustable and hand-built competition dampers, and softer springs. Further modifications include a protective roll cage, race seats with six-point harness, bonnet-mounted light pod and fire extinguisher. Moreover, the hydraulic handbrake, coupled with a limited slip differential, allowed to tackle sharp turns and drive on the loose terrain. Azaris from Ferox Ferox is the Australian-based startup that aims at lifting the adaptability and survivability of the humanity upon all land-based environments. The result of their work was the creation of a 6x6 wheel all-terrain vehicle that rides on the unique rocker suspension held by the DNA arms. Even though the Azaris is an awesome vehicle by itself, it was mostly created to show off the unique fluid drive system within wheel motors. Just like the electric powertrains, it has very high efficiency that reaches 98%, but any power source could be used, be it a combustion engine, a pure electric, a hybrid, or a fuel cell mill. What do you think about this lineup of off-roaders? Which one is the most ridiculously awesome? Share with us in the comment section and consider watching more episodes suggested on the screen. Subscribe to Automotive Territory to be notified about the new releases and may the torque be with you!